Hi everyone, it's Niall from amstradnoob.com and today we're going to take a quick look at connecting this 464 Plus to that LCD. To do it, we'll use this brand new RGB SCART lead adapter specifically for 464 or CPC 6128 computers. I bought this one from, from Retro Computer Shack. It cost $14.50, not including postage. Um, and as you can see, it's very nicely packaged. Still in the plastic bag, comes with uh, nicely printed instructions. It's really high quality, just like it says, high quality. So I already have a solution here, a HDMI uh, adapter. Uh, that's that one there, which already has another uh, RetroShack cable that uh, solution. But I use that for my 464, 664 and 6128 computers. It's not compatible with the 6128 Plus. So, I checked on Google and found that there was one from the same company available, so I went and ordered it. So, this is really a quick video just to check it out and see how it works. I haven't tried it yet. So here, here, here we go. It feels like a quality cable, not a cheap one. Uh, it looks fairly good, definitely. Nice little stickers on it as well, as you can see there. I mean, the guy that puts these together, he goes to a lot of trouble. There's another sticker. And this has got the right number of pins for connecting to a 464 or 6128 Plus. Uh, I see there's also this extra connector here, which is for five volt in DC there. And it's even labeled with the plus. And this will be five volt out, I presume. So let's connect it up and try it out. Okay, so first of all, connect up the video connector. And then, Connect the SCART to the back of my HDMI uh, adapter box. Pull out the old one. And this one. That's plugged in. And now we have this. These two cables coming from the uh, Retro Shack um, connector. So I'm going to plug the 5 volt directly into the 464 plus will be the same for the 6128 plus I assume this one 5 volt DC in doesn't have anything else to connect to it and if you read the instructions that come with this in here let's open them up it says switch off the computer connect the SCART lead to the computer blah 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 where does it say all right here we are power supply the Amstrad Plus computers get their power from the Amstrad monitor. To connect your computer to the TV with a SCART lead, you will require a suitable power supply not supplied. Plus 5 volt DC, 2.4 amps. So, and it gives you the DC uh, power plug size there, which is 2.5 times 5.5 millimeters. I have ordered this one here, but I do have a... 5 volts or universal power supply here. It's not quite powerful enough amp wise, as you can see, it's only 600 milliamps, but we can set 5 volts and it should have the correct size. So I'm going to try this anyway. And if it fails, um, I will try again with the higher, higher uh, ampage one that I've also ordered. So let's give it a shot. Here's the connectors. 
and some more connectors. And here is the little power supply itself. And let's see here. So it's going to be one of these. Five volts. And that's this little thing here. So we have to set this to five volts. And that will be this one. Let me just check that under the light. As you can see there, it's set to five volts. All right. Okay. Let's give this a try. So this will then connect into that. I don't think much of the quality of this. Okay, so there we go. Okay, I figured it out. Um, the instructions that came with this cheap power supply uh, were not great, to say the least. But if you can make it out here on the video, there is an arrow there and there's an arrow there. And you can also see that there's a plus on the center pin. So if you connect those two arrows together, that gives us the desired voltage. In other words, we've got the correct 2.5 um, 2.5 times 5.5 millimeter connector with plus in the center, and it's five volts set on the uh, power supply. So this one should be correct. All right, so let's connect it up and see how that goes. That's connected, I'm connecting the joystick. That's this one. And finally we connect um, 3.5 millimeter sound. And okay, we should be ready. Let's just turn on the sound. <clears throat> sound is on. Let's power on the CPC. And there we have it. It's working great. So if I do nothing, it will eventually uh, auto start uh, burning rubber. Or we can just press F2 and that should start it up. And there you can hear the audio. Good and loud. Okay, so that looks like it was successful. No thanks to the little power supply. Um, I hope you enjoyed this short video showing you how to connect your 464 Plus using a retro shack um, cable to an LCD. Uh, it certainly cuts down on the amount of space taken up on your table, which is great. Uh, those big white monitors with the built-in speakers, very nice, but they take up so much space. So this is perfect for me. I can flip between my 464 Plus and my regular Amstrad CPCs using this connector. Okay, great. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and comment. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. Thanks again for watching. See you in the next one.